I've always found the concept of time to be really intriguing, very interesting, and especially something that can be really taken advantage of by a filmmaker in his cinematic experience and in visual medium. But the ultimate task for us was how to take this concept and make it re feel real and tangible to an audience. How to take something that we've seen in many previous movies and make it feel original and realistic at the same time. And this was really early on, during an early draft of actually a short, short script that I wrote a couple years ago titled Counter Clock, in which it wasn't the subject going back in time, but rather the environment around them. So the subject would hit some sort of device, in this case the watch in the film, and everything around them would shift and go in reverse. And essentially, that person would be sent into a time in the past, but they would still be living in the present. It's just the environment around them that was shifted. And with that, there's a lot of things you can do visually. Things we are used to seeing go in real time, like gravity and water. We are used to seeing things fall down. In this film, we were able to make things rise up and make things that we we're used to seeing going forward go backwards. And it's a very subtle thing. I didn't want to go gargantuan and massive and have all these interesting ways of showing it, rather than just simplicity. The film on its own was incredibly difficult to create, to be able to master these practical effects of showing things going in reverse, because nearly every single shot of the film was done on camera. There were no visual effects or CGI enhancements, I wanted the film to feel as practical as possible. At the heart of it, Counter Clock is really just a love story, and it's really simple under the surface, but it's surrounded by this massive gargantuan concept that allows for the audience to be immersed in this world even more. And it's really an introduction to this time travel story that we've created, but I believe that audiences will really get a kick out of it. And I just can't wait for people to watch it.